Hey, Mod Productions back with another video about records. This time we're focusing on covers. They may look like they have a record in them, but inside, it's empty. Now the covers matter when you're buying a record too. If you watch my first video about um, me with the actual records, it'll tell you the grading scale. This also applies to covers. Here's yesterday and today. I'm not sure if you can see. But, here, let me put it up to the camera. There's some slight ring wear right where my finger is. And so that, except overall, it's perfect. Nearly perfect. So that would probably be about, that would probably be very good plus. And revolver here, this, definitely near mint. Definitely. There's almost nowhere on here. There's like a little bend here or something like that. And same with Beatles 65. The only thing bad about this cover is it has a slight little bend here and then it's kind of yellowish on the back. Here is a little 45 sleeve. Pretty much perfect except for it looks like a price tag's been ripped off. And um, also uh, this is bent too. So yeah, that's also pretty good too. Those, all the albums I showed you right now, well, this would probably be a very good plus, just like yesterday and today, except Revolver and Beetle 65, I showed you them, they were, they're probably near mint. This would also be a very good plus, this is pretty good, but you know it has some bends around here too, and also, yeah, and there's the inside of that one too. So, yeah, always make sure that your covers are in decent condition, too. Uh, another thing on the Butcher cover, too, like yesterday and today, if you wanted to know if this was really original, we'll obviously look in the book to make sure if it's original or not, but there's one thing that you can do to make sure if it's a paste-over or not, like if you're looking for a second state paste-over. Um, if you look around this area, Ringo, like look diagonally down from Ringo's head, um, right here, if you look very closely, and then you looked at a picture of the butcher cover, you'd notice that if you looked at your paste over, if it was one, you could see Ringo's smock going around the trunk, like where he was sitting underneath the trunk cover. So that's how you can tell if you've got a butcher cover underneath. Alright, well that's it on covers. Thanks.